So if you look across the published scientific literature, uh, you will realize that the majority of uh, the studies that present uh, a new finding that is claimed to be statistically significant are unlikely not to have found something that is uh, as major as they have claimed. Uh, this changes if you have more studies done on the same topic, so you have replications, if you have larger studies, if you can get rid of biases and conflicts of interest in the process of doing the research, and uh, if uh, you can get better designs and uh, better tools for doing your research. So on average, and there's a lot of variability across fields, the first time you hear about something, it's more likely to be wrong. But if you do your, th your work correctly, it's eventually going to be more correct downstream. There is a lot of scientific disciplines that currently are making a very conscious effort to try to replicate, try to reproduce uh, the results of some of their key studies that they have come up with. And uh, to give you one example, uh, lots of scientists working in psychological sciences uh, decided to join forces and look at 100 papers that had been published in their best journals and to see whether they could repeat these experiments and get the same results. Two out of three times they got different results, uh, even though they tried to follow as closely what had been done originally and uh, they even communicated with the original investigators to try to make sure that uh, they do something that is as close as possible to the original design of the first study. I think that it is important for the wider public to understand what science is about, why it is the best thing that has happened to human beings, and why it is important to invest in science. Uh, science is, uh, of course, about curiosity, and sometimes people may think that uh, weird people ask weird questions. But eventually, these questions translate to major benefits for our everyday life. Uh, science is what leads to progress eventually in our society and makes our lives better. In terms of medical science, it also makes our lives uh, better in quality and in duration. So it's, it's important to know how difficult it is to do science, to do good science, and how important it is to communicate uh, with people how this is done. I, I think we may strive to aim a situation where everybody is a scientist. Every human is a scientist, and, and we should try to revive and strengthen that scientist in all of us. Thank you. I hope that was close yeah, to yeah. what you had in mind. <laughs> Thank you.